excited. <laughs> My name is Kanade. My daughter Ompu is the one who is excited in front of the door right now. Why is Ompu acting like a dog waiting for the owner to return? Three days ago, online shopping, limited edition, life size puni cushions, limited quantities of puni available online. Only now you can buy it. Now's the chance, Puni. If you're curious about it, quickly charge, charge, charge money. Use more and more money, Puni. Wow! Huh? Ompu is not usually the kind of kid who sounds spoiled, but something about this cushion seemed to have an extraordinary appeal. She was glued to the commercials, with the weird character screaming, Charge money! Hey, Mom! This! I want this! Please! It's rare to see you wanting to buy character stuff, Ompu. Please! Buy this as a birthday present? What? Your birthday was just the other day, right? You know, I gave you a book of Nietzsche quotes as a present. What? It's now or never! Please, please, please! If you won't get it as a birthday present, can you get it as a Christmas present? This cushion is a 120 centimeters high beaded cushion, and when I just sit on it, the shame memory reduces the burden on my body. I'll be able to have the best posture when reading. Oh, I get it now. I get it. Alright, I'll buy it. What? Really? You've been working so hard lately, so I'm going to buy you something as a reward. Yay! Thanks, mommy! So, I bought a cushion online that Ompu wanted. The scheduled arrival is today, at this time. But still, I looked at the delivery status and it says that it has already been delivered. That's strange, it's not here yet. What? Mom, could it be that you chose unattended delivery? Huh? See? I know it, Mom. You're being careless, like always. Ah, uh, it's true. Then maybe it's already in front of the door. Let's take a look. Yes! The life-sized pony cushion is finally in my hands. What? What? It's... it's not here? that was supposed to be left unattended was not at the front door. Ompu fell to the ground out of shock. I then tried to check with the delivery company, but the person in charge was adamant that the delivery had been completed. I couldn't find out anymore, but... Ah! I'm home! I'm supposed to get a watch today from a friend of mine. Has it already arrived? I was wondering... What in the world is going on? Your front porch is like hell. Ah, uh, Alto. Then my husband. Alto arrived home. Actually, this and that happened. By the way, the watch hasn't arrived. Hmm, that's strange. Someone I know said they sent it, but... Well, how about we wait a little longer? As for the cushion... Well, Kanade, you're a bit fuzzy. Maybe you made a mistake typing in the address since the shipping company said it's already been delivered. Well, I don't know. I'd probably done it. I'm a bit fuzzy. So you are aware of it. Well, I guess that's the way it is, so let's just give up. Give up? I don't want to do that. You're terrible, Dad. Whoa, what's with the suddenness? You startled me. That cushion is 120 centimeters high beaded cushion. And just as I sit... The shape memory reduces the burden on the body and makes the best posture for reading. Wow, that's enough! Okay, alright, I understand. I understand exactly what you want me to do. We have no choice but to order another one. Wow, Dad, really? Thank you! You're the best! So cool! You're in a good mood, aren't you? You told me I was terrible earlier, didn't you? Yeah... And so, a few days went by after Alto bought another one. Similarly, the delivery status was delivered. But the life-size pony cushion never arrived. The pony is not here. And then I called again to make sure it was okay. 
You really are a persistent one too, aren't you? Yes, you're right. Delivery has been completed. I even took a picture of the completed unattended delivery, you know. Is... is that so? The response from the shipping company was the same as last time. Ompu... I'm sorry. I don't know what to do anymore. Do you want me to make you a cushion? I don't need that! You really say it that clearly? I might look like this, but I was good at home economics. Don't worry, I'll make you something cute. It won't mean anything if you're the one who makes it. What? How in the world did this happen? Who is doing this mean to me? I will never forgive that person. I'm glad for your feelings, but I need to make sure this case is solved. In the name of my grandpa. Hinbaiji, Pony? But why on earth doesn't it arrive here? As a mother, I wish I could do something for the depressed Onpu, but I have absolutely no idea what to do. Ah, could it be that Alto stopped my credit card to prevent me from shopping? No, that's unlikely. There's no way Alto would do such a thing. Ah, hello, neighbor Sato. Ah, hello. What a hot day today, too. You're right. Ah. Hey, did you hear? The manager of the condo and the girl in room 203? I heard that they got pregnant. Triangle accessory. I think the triangle was the mark of some kind of shady secret society. Kanade? Kanade? Are you listening? Y yes huh? Well, is it because it's very hot? That you're so spaced out? Oh, I guess in your case, it's from the beginning, isn't it? <laughs> well then, I'll get back to what I was doing now. Okay then. Could it be that our neighbor Sato? That's possible. Then I decided to talk to my mom friend, Haru, about this. That's what happened. And Onpu even said in the name of her grandfather. I'm already in a lot of trouble. I'm stepping on my neighbor's suspicious feet. What? Your neighbor? Did you see something suspicious? Yeah, actually. I think my neighbor is that of a secret society. She wears triangular stuff. A lot. Maybe there's some kind of conspiracy theory there. Kanade. You are easily influenced by the TV. Well, what can I say? The truth can be hidden in places where you think it's absolutely not suspicious. You know how they say it's dark under the land? Hmm, I guess so. Having Haru listen to me has eased my mind somewhat, but we haven't solved the problem. Since the incident, Onpu has been looking a little down. I'm home. Welcome back home. Huh? Ombu? What are you doing? Well, I'm playing pretend demon slayer. It doesn't seem like it though. Ombu, are you okay? You know what? I just looked at the cushion you wanted. It's in limited quantity, but they still have a few more left. Do you want me to order another one? What? Is it okay? I want you to feel better, Ombu. You don't have to be so reserved here, you know? I thought it was bad for your education, so I refrained from buying it, but to be honest, we are quite rich. You don't have to worry about anything. That's overly frank, Pony. No, Mom. That's not what I meant. Huh? It means you don't have to buy anymore, so it's okay. Meaning? I have a special plan. A plan? I'll get the life-size pony cushion back for sure. Heave-ho! Heave-ho! What's that? Don't tell anyone. There's something to anticipate later. Something to anticipate? Perhaps a sequel to The Demon Slayer? No, it's not. Can I open it? Whoa! No, don't. Huh? What? After she put the box down, Ompu went about her day as if nothing had happened. I had no idea what Ompu was up to, but... La 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 la! She's even humming. Ah! <laughs> What's going on? Huh? What happened? <laughs> he fell for it! What do you mean, he fell for it? That you 
Let's see when you go to the front door. Look! Let's hurry and go. Umbu? Wait a minute, it's dangerous. It's not like that. It's okay, it's okay. Ah, uh, hey, Umbu. Huh? Ouch. What? Wait, who are you? Are you alright? I see. So it's this person. This guy is the delivery man of this panel's transport. The delivery man? Why is he lying here? I can't keep up with what's happening. Ouch. Oh, you're awake now? Good morning. What in the world is... Where am I? Who am I? Here. This is right in front of my house. And you are the one who took my life sight puny cushion. Huh? Wh what are you talking about? Hmm? What's going on? The watch you're wearing, it's the same one as the one my friend sent me. Can I take a look at it? What? Huh? Oh, I knew it. This is the serial number. I thought it was odd that someone I knew said they sent it, but... You mean you? The delivery guy was the one who took it? What in the world are you doing? The, there's no way. Why do you assume such a thing? I just fell down here for a minute, and this watch is just a heap. That excuse is a tough one. Then let me ask you, why are you lying here? Isn't it because you opened this box without permission and were surprised by the contents? The, there's no way that... What in the world is this? Oh, Mom, it's dangerous! Huh? This is my present to the delivery man. It's filled with a lot of toy cockroaches. Uh, roach? Eep! It was so difficult to collect these, you know? I'm so sorry for inconveniencing you. Eep! Stop it! Stop it! I told you, they're just toys. I knew you would definitely take a box of luxury brand if they were placed here. So, I ripped the contents. And so, then, when you check the contents, you'll scream, right? Well, I didn't expect it to go so well. The operation was a great success. No, it's not. There's no way I would do something that bad to get my hands on unintended delivery. It's a misunderstanding. I just got curious this time and came to take a look. Hmm, but I actually had my suspicions about the delivery guy before. The only man who can get in here are our neighbors and the delivery man, right? Our neighbor was on vacation the last day the cushions were supposed to arrive. So I thought maybe we can narrow down the culprit. This time, they just set it up to keep the currents down. Ugh! I had no idea that it was the delivery guy from the shipping company who was taking the unattended delivery every time. This is the lightning thing that Haru was talking about. It's dark under the lamp, Puni. Our neighbor, Sato, I feel sorry I dealt in her. And I apologize in my heart. You! Why don't you just give up? I will be sure to report this matter to the shipping company. Uh, 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 I'm sorry. I admit it. I admit it. So please don't. I'm having a hard time making ends meet. I don't want to lose my job. What? That doesn't mean it's okay to take someone's stuff, does it? Give it back. Give it back. Uh, um, that cushion was a limited edition. Well... I sold it on a flea market site. I don't have it anymore. What? <sighs> well then, I'm sorry, but I will report you to your company. But... It seems there's nothing that can be done anyway. <sighs> Afterwards, the delivery man's company got informed. It seems that he also took the unattended delivery of other people too. It resulted in more than just losing his job. Then, the next day, ah, someone came. Umpu, please go and check the door. Huh? Yes. Wow, Pony is finally here. The shipping company took care of it, and both of the life-size Pony cushions that were supposed to be delivered to us were delivered to us safely. And Umpu was very happy. Umpu's smile is twice as big as mine, so I guess that's a good thing. Dad? Mom? Thank you! <laughs> that's two, so I guess that means they're for Christmas and your next birthday present. What? 
Just kidding. <laughs>